it's December, the holiday season, which means I already have my letter for Santa. So first, you have a letter for Santa? Well, yeah, I have a bunch of cards I would love to have banned for the next season. And if there's anyone out there that can grant my wishes, it's Santa Claus. Oh, grow up, Dragon Lady. Santa doesn't care about what cards you want to have banned. Also, I don't think he has that kind of power. Okay, you know what? Seeing you're being such a Grinch, I'm gonna put you into the Holy Spirit. I hate you. Yeah, well, the feeling's mutual. Anyway, on to my ban list wish list. So this wish list is going to be a combination of both myself and my husband. My husband made his own list on our local Facebook page and I looked through it and yeah, he made a few points. So some of the cards I'll talk about are also cards that uh, he would also like to see banned. So the first card should be no surprise to anyone, a small grenade of the thief, a magic equipped card that if you destroy, you can look at your opponent's hand and take out a card. And the problem with this card is just so easy to abuse and recycle. And yeah, you're just going to keep ripping cards from your opponent's hands. Now, I personally have not encountered this move uh, going online but a lot of people have so yeah i've been hearing a lot of people complain like yes this card has got to go next i think dragon link should take a hit that deck is just insanely powerful so i think one of the guard dragons should be banned i mean i don't know i don't care just just pick your poison lp pissy just pick one but you know when i really 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 think about it maybe i'm edging slightly toward lp because that it's a monster directly from the deck, which is insane, but at the same time, Pitsy can bring back a card from the grave or even from being banished. Either or, one of these guys got to go. And while we're on the subject of Dragon Link, I think Borlo Savage Dragon should also be banned. He's easy to get out, has multiple negates, and it doesn't necessarily have to be in a Dragon Link deck. It's a generic level 7 synchro monster, so almost any deck with the right tuners can get him out and he also gets a power boost from the monster that he's equipped with so i know i'm the dragon lady i love dragons but listen when the deck gets too strong it has to be held in check number s zero really why is this card still legal why is this even a card come on konami ban this Ban this forever! Like, it stops you from playing the game, just... No! Uh, it's a monster! Kill it! Kill it! Says the duelist who supports Mystic Mine. Kill it! Kill it! XX Saber Gotems. Now, this is a card that my husband would like to see banned, and initially I wasn't really sure why. However, Virtual World is the current power deck, and he plays online more than I do, and he said that he's seen three XX Sabers summoned at the same time, which results in three cards being ripped from your hand. And if we learn anything from the smoke grenade, having cards ripped from your hand indiscriminately like that just isn't fair. Dragon Buster Destruction Sword, no explanation required. You just equip him to a monster and your opponent's extra deck is locked out. Now, if this card doesn't go, Maybe Union Hanger should take a hit, but let's be real, it, it's the Dragon Buster Sword that's the real problem here. VFD. I'll be honest, the reason I never talked about this card in my previous wish list is because I never seen him being used online, and so I did not consider him to be that big of a deal. And while he can be summoned in Danger Blue Eyes with a lot of consistency, the combo can be easily interrupted by hitting a key card. Virtual World, however, can bring a VFD much easier, so yeah, I can see how the threat is more real. Okay, dinos, dinos, they they be strong. Oh yeah, so I think there's a few cards that should take a hit. Uh, either Soul Eating Oviraptor or Miscellaneous Source. 
So eating raptor, that just starts off an entire mess of combos to get an unbreakable board and miscellaneous source. I mean, what can I say? Just discard them from your hand and all your dinos are immune to everything. Both cards are very problematic, but if I had to choose one, maybe the over raptor should go first. But that's just me. So the next three cards I have placed in the same category, it's more or less if one gets banned and the others don't need to, it's the kind of group that something has to go in order to maintain the balance. First is Needle Fiber. Boo! Oh, boo yourself. Needle Fiber has been a problematic card ever since its release. It's a one card combo that leads to insane negate board. So yeah, not very fun. Link Cross, because when combined with Needle Fiber, it continues on with those insane plays to lead up to those crazy boards. So if Needle Fiber does not get banned, then Link Cross should definitely take the hit. And last but not least, Metal Marcher. If neither Needle Fiber or Link Cross takes a hit, Metal Marcher should go, because allowing you to special summon a tuner from the grave and continue to sink on to sink on, yeah, that, that do be creating some degenerate plays. Okay, that's it for the ban list. Now I do have a few cards I would like to have limited to one. Not as many, but here's what I think. I would like to start with the Invoked Engine. Doesn't matter which card, the Meltdown, Invocation, Alistair, this engine is extremely consistent. Almost any deck can use it. I think by limiting one of these cards to one should keep it in check. This is an unpopular opinion, but it's just me. I think this engine should take a hit in some shape or form. Another card that my husband would like to get limited would be Rocket Tracer, and I can see why. It's a part of the Rocket Dragon engine, it's a part of Dragon Links, and Rocket Tracer is one of those cards that sets everything in motion. So yeah, if that got limited to one, I don't think it would be that big a deal because it's still searchable. Another card he would like to see would be Dogmatica Punishment. Holy moly, is this card ever powerful. And it doesn't have to be used in Dogmatica. This card can be used in almost any deck you want. If anything, I kind of want it for my Ritual Control deck because I don't utilize the extra deck at all and I can send an extra deck monster to my grave to take advantage of the grave effects. So no, I don't think this card is ban worthy, but I do think limiting it to one would be fair. And last but not least again, Mystic Mind. Kill it! Yeah! And yes, I am a supporter of this card, but I think it's time that it takes a hit. And even if it does, it's still searchable through other means. So if Mystic Mind gets hit to one, I don't think it would be a dead card. I'm sure a lot of people could still find uses for it. I don't really have a preference for semi-limiting cards. To me, there's almost no difference between two cards and three cards. To remove from the list, I want Call by the Grave back to three. Having this card restricted to one meant moving all the negates from the board to the hand. And a lot of people can do both. There is nothing stopping you from stopping your deck with hand traps, and with one called by, there is nothing you can do about it. It is likely that Konami placed a limit on called by for marketing reasons, with Crossout Designator coming out in the future. It has not showed up soon enough. For a game to remain healthy, you can't sacrifice balance for marketing. I understand Konami is a business who are out to sell cards, but if a lack of balance causes people to leave the game, who's buying your cards now? A lot of people have opinions on the status of this card, so let me know what you think in the comments below. And I'm sure you're all wondering, what does the Dragon Lady think of best Sayuja Skuldred? Kill it! Kill it! You know what? I just don't care anymore. So that is my ban list wish list for December 2020. What do you all think? What cards do you think should take a hit? Let me know in the comments below. And as always, remember to be a good sport, play the game, not the fame. Bye bye! Lock out your opponent's extra. And why is my Snapchat going up? I gotta get rid of it. Oh, guys, stop.